Now going back though to the day trader or investor status for tax purposes, this distinction between investor and trader per the IRS is very important because tax rules are generally more favorable for traders. As a general rule, most taxpayers are categorized as investors. So most people who have participation in the stock market are classified as investors. However, in today's setting of common online retail trading, all the discount brokers, Trade Zero, and all of these guys, and all of these companies, often traders, often more people are buying and selling stocks in shorter time frames than ever before. So most of these people, of course, are classified as traders but they're not necessarily receiving trader status per the IRS. So it's very important that you receive that status to help optimize your tax returns. Otherwise, you're going to be viewed the same as an investor that holds a stock investment for five or 10 years, which of course applies a very different strategy to your stock portfolio.